the moment, there are around 700,000 deaths from multidrug resistant infections. And what I love about my research is that we're trying to help solve that problem. So the nanoparticles that I'm designing will act as a Trojan horse. So the resistant bacteria don't recognize them as an enemy. They uptake them and they will eventually die. So being associated with Sydney Nano means that I have access to seminars and workshops. So there's a great educational aspect of it. And Sydney Nano also provides opportunities to interact with people from different research fields, that, which is something that I find very valuable. I decided to get involved with the Sydney Nano community because it's a multidisciplinary team. So they bring together experts from different disciplines, that way they expose me to new challenges and new insights that I otherwise wouldn't be exposed to. Sydney Nano has been very supportive by organising seminars and workshops regularly and also networking events. So there's also a social aspect of being a part of the community. And they also provide awards to support cross faculties and cross universities collaborations. So there is the um, Research Collaboration Award, which allows, allows me to work with another research group. And there's also the Harvard Mobility Scheme that provides international mobility. If I could share a take home message, I would say to just be open. Um, be willing to try new things, just be brave.